Sugar Water and Apes Hill offered at 3.3 million US dollars, built by EcoStructure here in Barbados. Just told the owner, it's my favourite property on the island. I don't think he believes me, but I think he might have done. You never know. Pretty much 100% edible garden. Everything from Bajan cherries to bananas, pineapple, and in the rear, pawpaw. Or papaya, as you say in Europe. The gully, if memory serves me, is full of fruit trees. Banana. Bananas, apparently. Although we're looking at... The house is currently rented out, so aloe everywhere. Yes, please. Normally I talk non-stop on these videos. I just don't think this property needs a lot of conversation. It's an absolute stunner. These holes in the floor are for uh, a safety fence if you have young children. A safety fence that can fold away. House faces southeast to pick up the prevailing winds. We're going to look at the kitchen area there. I'm talking quietly now because there's a bit of a meeting going on through to the service area. Guest WC or housekeeper's WC if you like. The housekeeper. Hello love. Hello. Laundry area, linen area. And through there, that rock area through there, is a uh, is all set up to be a wine, a large wine cellar. So bedroom number four of a four bedroom house. All the rooms are our suite. All the water is aerated, so there's 30 to 40 percent saving. Everything is fully solar. Last year's electric bill was $200, Barbados. That's less than 100 pounds for a whole year on a four-bedroom house. The rooms are connected through an outdoor corridor. The feeling of living outdoors, yet indoors, is just remarkable. There I am in a mirror again. I just cannot seem to avoid that. I'm not sure if it's me, or if this country has too many mirrors. Very, very solid wood doors. Fabulous bathroom, this. That area there is actually being used as storage, so I won't open it up. But you can get an idea of how truly stunning this property is looking out to the rear there. Fantastic, absolutely fantastic. Sliding glass doors here. Let's hope that won't break. And then one looks out, wake up in the morning and walk out to that. Whew, amazing. Five minutes to hold him. Maybe a little bit longer, but five minutes really, I would say, to hold him. Look at that. Whew, I see this house a lot and I walk-in closet and bathroom here. I see this house a lot and uh, it still takes my breath away. It really, really does. I just think it's, it's just superb. Every bedroom has a little seating area outside. So if you do want to get away, more bananas, more bananas. Aloe, which although tastes disgusting is actually edible. Lovely seating area here. And then we go through to the master. Now the interesting thing about the master is, one goes into the master, bedroom on this side, but one can actually go turn right and go to the bathroom on that side. I'm gonna use, use, I'm not gonna use the bedroom. I'm gonna walk through to the bedroom first, where one can relax in absolute style. I'm not being rude now, but that company that makes that fan is the big ass fan company which I must say amuses me immensely all the time and amuses my son even more. Enjoy listening to this video. So one can step down here from the bedroom, four steps, swim across and go and get your own 
the fence line there is where, not where the property stops, but that for construction purposes made sense. You own halfway into the gully and the gully is absolutely filled with fruit trees. Planted by the developer stroke owner. So one wakes up in the morning, don't want to get on people's bed. And that's what you get. Sadly, the sun's just gone in. So not quite as dramatic as it might have been. Walk-in closet, and in one of the most beautiful bathrooms. The floors are a... I can't remember, a reclaimed wood. Very wide beam. Some are wide, some are narrow. Gives it a very natural feel. Wonderful marble. Bathroom, again, shower, rain head. Three lights on this one, his and hers sink, and then the pièce de résistance, if you want to bath, bath, bathe, outside you go. Let me step back from that. That's just fantastic. Ginger lilies, bananas, golden palms. Look at these poor poor trees. Last time I saw a poor poor tree like this, it was in St. Lucia. My under oh chilies, look, chilies, chilies. Look at me getting all excited. I'm useless with plants, so it's not surprising I get excited. More chilies. Gotta say I do love hot food. Gardener busy at it. More solar panels. You've got every blasted thing in here, amazing. A little pathway going down to the side and a gate. An amazing house, a, a really, really amazing house at 3.3 million, offered at Sandcastle Real Estate, www.barbados-realestate.com. Anyone for rum punch? Goodness me, look at that.